Jason Wilcox lays that one off well. Back it comes through the centre. In goes Swan. An excellent turn by Howard Gale, but Swan stayed with him. Martin Foyle, a good layoff. Now this could be dangerous. A beautiful ball. And Brian Mills, can he do it this time as he cuts through? He's brought down a penalty. Is it? Our referee, surely. The corner flags are almost horizontal in the wind then. As Rovers take this kick again and in swinger. Vandalan misses the ball. This could be dangerous. Swept away, but it's going to come back very quickly indeed. As it takes a deflection, the flag is up. And offside has been given. So I think Vale perhaps compensated for the poor decision by the referee at the far end when Brian Mills was brought down in the end. A good back header. Vandalan trying to get a shot in, it's blocked again. Vale just not getting on the end of it. A good turn there by Brian Mills. He turns his man beautifully, tries to turn him a second time and wins another corner. No lack of confidence in this youngster from Rudesley. Certainly one for the future, Brian Mills. Kevin Kent from the right. Van der Lange goes in strong, and it's there! Vale have scored! A goal to the Vale, and the congratulations are going to Dean Glover. Penalty area. It would be a tragedy if they allowed Rovers to score at this late stage. And... Vandalan managed to get to it, the ball bubbling about, it hits a defender, it's partially cleared, Webb trying to come away with the ball, and wide of the post. Simon Mills trying to force his way through, failing to do so, and there is the final whistle. Port Vale have won this first round of the Zenith Data Cup against Blackburn Rovers.